We're on your side tonight as a small town remembers a big name. Andre Rene Rosimov was born in France, but ended up calling North Carolina his home. Better known as Andre the Giant, a massive man standing seven foot four, weighing more than 500 pounds. Of course, was an icon in the world of pro wrestling. Now, 30 years after his death, his adopted hometown is hoping for an economic spark to really just commemorate his life. WBTV photojournalist Gregory Simpson brings us the story. We're in Ellerby, North Carolina in Richmond County. We're about 60 miles from Charlotte. We're about 70 miles south of Greensboro. An hour from Greensboro, an hour and a half from Raleigh, and an hour and a half from Charlotte. It's right here in the heart of rural North Carolina. Um, Ellerby's a tall, small town here. Dr. Rankin was a local doctor here. He was from up, right up the road in Mount Gilead. Um, he began his practice here in Ellerby. He was a lifelong collector of all kinds of things, starting with Native American artifacts um, and moving on into pottery, local items, things from South America. Um, he had a lifelong collection in 1985. Um, he started building Rankin Museum. The museum opened in 1987. Um, and we're a museum of natural history. We have exhibits from all over the world, um, even local exhibits here from Richmond County. Um, and in 2015, we added the Andre the Giant exhibit. Andre the Giant was born in France, um, began his career wrestling, which took him all over the world. Um, he spent a lot of time in North America as well as Japan, is what a lot of people don't realize. Um, and he ended up, ended up settling here the last 13, 14 years of his life here in Ellerby. There was a local guy here in Ellerby that had close ties with some of the wrestling community in Charlotte. He would have big um, get-togethers and cookouts at his house. And Andre ended up getting invited once, twice, a few times. and. I've been told that Andre really enjoyed it because it reminded him here in Ellerby and especially there at the ranch of where he grew up in France. Jackie McCauley was a very close friend of Andre the Giant. In 2015, Jackie came to us and wanted to donate a lot of her memorabilia to the museum so it could be displayed so the local community could um, see it and it could stay right here in Ellerby. Andre's you know, been dead 30 years this year. I thought it was a great time to move forward with some kind of a, an event. Um, we've, we've talked about the board, and here locally, we've always kind of dreamed of doing an event um, celebrating the life of Andre. This past January, he's been gone for 30 years. Um, I developed a relationship with Leland Sports Memorabilia in New Jersey, told them about the idea, and they wanted to help and now we have wrestling stars coming from all over the country to do a meet and greet. We've got a street fair. It's gonna be from one to six on Saturday. And at 7 p.m., the bell rings and we will have live wrestling right here in the streets of Ellaby. You know, this isn't just an event for Rankin Museum. It's an event about our community in Ellerby and our county um, and surrounding counties, um, specifically for our town. Um, we really want to bring people and put, put Ellerby back on the map. A lot of people come in. We have visitors from hundreds of miles away that walk in the door right there just to come see this exhibit. And we know that we're going to draw a crowd, but we want everyone in the town to benefit from it. You know, people are going to come here. They're going to buy gas. They're going to go to the restaurants. They're going to go to the stores, some of the antique shops. And we want everyone in the community to, to benefit from this um, and really get people um, from far away and close by to know what we have here in town and hopefully bring people back in the future.